Okay, so Big Night Ride is facing a bunch of rats. They fake going B, but they actually play A and kill two teammates there. Oh my God. The enemy gave away his position, which is a death sentence against me, so I quickly kill him. I make my way to the middle, but the Rachel noob ping me, so his friends can all see me through the wall. So you can see, they will follow me in the kill cam through the wall and, and just kill me, because I just didn't really check that spot. When you go around the corner, you just aim where the enemy can be. If you think there might be someone there, you have to put the center of your screen right there, so you just have to shoot when you see him. So don't look your feet or the sky. And um, I know what my enemies are gonna do, and I expect them to rush the middle. And so now there is two players in A. I see him behind the truck, so I use my C4, but my, my teammate is there, and he defeats him. So, I'm gonna rush to get the bomb planted. I know they must be on B, because we killed three players at least on A, and one got killed from the roof. So, I managed to get the control of middle, and I'm gonna see my opponent, and I'm quickly gonna hide. So he's gonna aim way too high, and I'm gonna kill him because of that. So, my teammate Bell was near the bomb, so he could have protected me, but I was 100% sure that the guy was just hiding in B, so I think it was better to spot him and to get the kill. As the bomb carrier, I have to stay alive and I also have to control the middle as my friend Bell is watching the other side and we, we are getting surprised but it doesn't matter because he is protecting me so I'm trying to push middle with my smoke and uh, I see the sniper but I have to hide and I'm expecting someone to follow me so so he could also be on B, but I just played it safely and uh, I mute that teammate because he's not letting me play with his microphone and I just get the, the kill, you know, I was hiding so I just take the, the pick and even though you should not pick from the right to the left, here it was a good option because I already knew the position of that guy and he's not able to to get a quick sniper kill on, on someone like me. So we are gonna win the match very easily. These guys are just terrified and they are shitting themselves. This noob toilet roll choose to camp in this area. My friend Bell kills him and so they, they just rage quit. And as you can see on the score, only three players are enough to beat the noob team. So it's very important to scare your enemy, to show them that you are there. So you have to be aggressive on the first round. You have to use the pre-fire technique to show that you are here. And uh, I don't have much resistance. I don't see anyone. So I'm just trying to keep killing them, you know, like... We are in attack, so I attack them. My teammate just died with a bomb, so I have to pick it up. And I expect the guys to protect the bomb, so... My opponents are scared that I'm gonna do the same thing, so they are gonna block me, so I have to do something else, because it's attack. I have to do something else. I fake broken the glass, but I actually go below. They kill my teammate right here, and uh, I pre-fire, because the pre-fire shooting like that is the best way to clear a room. You should never pick from the right to the left, but you can compensate with a jump pick or uh, with an automatic fire and so I did both I I prefire and I, I jumped so they just die with a bomb once again on a I'm trying to make my way silently because if I give away my position they they can kill me very easily I have one minute to pick the bomb so I prefer to surprise them so I really check every corners and I take my time but sometimes Sometimes being sneaky is not actually a good solution and you have to be loud and proud and just pre fire and shoot all over the place for expecting us to get that bomb. I think it was obvious. And there I, I tried to play it safely 
and uh, I didn't pre-fire, so this guy, he wasn't scared and he just killed me. Could have shot him through the wall or anything. So I do something different now. Me and my teammate, they, we don't push middle, so I try to do it this time. I pick up the gun from the ground. Basically, defense is a lot easier than attack, so you really have to play the objective. I see nobody is protecting B, so I'm making my way up there. I spot the bomb, so I tell my teammate and I ping. This little guy took the bomb, so I have to chase him. So I'm always aiming the center of my screen where the enemy could be. I'm not watching the ground, I'm not watching the sky. Apparently there is someone behind me, but I don't really care. My objective is the bomb. I kill him, so now I know the bomb is right there. Hello, As I told you previously, you have to be very aggressive on the first round to scare them away, so they don't push you. Uh, that's the same thing in attack and in defense. You always have to be aggressive on the first round. This is my territory, so um, I show them who's the boss really, but this camper, this camper kills me. These rats are camping in the bedroom and they use a drone to reveal my position, so I have to move away and attack this camper. So I'm just making my way up there very silently, and so yeah, I just use the jump to move very fastly and to kill this stupid noob. So that's what I do against this stupid camper that I just easily headshot. So I think there is one more player there, but my teammate is going in the other side. I control the other part, but my teammate dies, so I know he's in the other bedroom on the other side of the building. So I try to jump back on the bridge, but I just, I just miss my jump. So I'm heading back to the bomb. When you try to plant the bomb, you make some noise when you defuse it as well, so he has 20 seconds to plant the bomb and I'm gonna hear him now. So I know he's in A, but I cannot see him, so I wait for him to get away and I easily kill him. And so now I'm gonna show you the most important trick. You unmute someone, you insult this person, you tell her that she is very bad at the game, and then you speak about her mother, and you mute her again. Just like that. Unmute, insult, and mute again. So I damage them, and I get damaged by the explosion of the car. So I heal back again, and I just make my way silently. There is one more player behind the car. Don't be like this guy, you have to aim where the enemy can appear. Don't watch the center of the car. 